how is it going everyone welcome back to another Wheel Assassin video thank you very much for tuning in with me today in today's video I'm going to be teaching you guys how to build Marge Simpson from of course the Simpsons now if you didn't see the Homer episode definitely check that out in the link in the description below or you can go ahead and go to the Simpsons playlist of micro tutorials we have got many more to come throughout the series so definitely stay tuned for those and in today's video of course we're going to be building Marge Simpson so definitely stay tuned to the end so we can get this lady built Alrighty, let's go ahead and grab the materials we need and get started. Alright then guys, so taking a nice big area where you're going to build your marge, we're going to take our materials, lime concrete, yellow concrete, red concrete, red wool, black concrete, white concrete, and of course some blue wool for Marge's hair. So the first thing we're going to do is take our lime concrete and we're going to build the dress that Marge has. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven blocks long with our lime concrete like so. Then we're going to leave a gap just here on the corner and we're going to go one, two, three, four. Now we're going to leave a gap on the corner and make the back seven long again. Oops, that's eight. There we go. Seven long like that. And then leave a gap and make your four this side as well. Awesome. Now we're going to go up a couple blocks. So we're going to go a row around all of these to make this a row of two now for every single wall. Then we're going to go and do another one. Like so. And then we're going to do a fourth one. And then this is where we're going to stop. So a fourth one of lime concrete all the way around. Like so. That looks great. Then we're going to take our yellow concrete. And we're going to do one row of yellow concrete around the top of the dress now. Like so. Awesome. That is looking great. So that's kind of representing Marge's neck. We're going to go ahead and add the arms in now. So we're going to go down here. And where the dress kind of finishes we're going to add are two yellow concrete blocks just there to kind of start the arms and these are going to go all the way to the floor like so on both sides as well definitely want to make them on both sides wicked that looks really really good that is the kind of start of marge the bust sort of area of marge that's kind of where we're going to add the head on top and things like that so taking our red concrete and our red wool we're going to make the pearls that that marge has on so we're going to go red concrete there uh red wool Concrete, wool, 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 concrete, and wool. Whew. Very, very hard to say all that stuff. <laughs> um, so there we go. We're just going to alternate between the two so you can make it look like there's actually the, the concrete ones are the pearls. These are kind of the string that holds the pearls together. So that's pretty cool. That is great. Alrighty, so we're going to go on to the head now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do this at a step at a time. So I'm going to build the face first of all, then we're going to add the rest of the head afterwards. So definitely bear with me, definitely stay tuned and we'll get this done. So yellow concrete, we're going to fill over this entire space now to make sure the head has a nice kind of base plate to build it on, like so. Then we're going to place a row of seven just like so. Then we're going to bring five blocks of yellow concrete on top of the piles like so. Then we're going to do one, two, one, two on the ends of the seven row back there. And we're going to stack this up for another two blocks, like so. Then we're going to go ahead and add a row of five along. So now we have room for the smile. We're going to add the smile in with black concrete in there. Wicked. Then we're going to go ahead and add the nose. And the nose just sticks out of Marge's kind of face just by one block overhanging the smile. So we're going to go just there and one block. You could actually add the second block just here just to mark up where it's going to be on the inside as well. But if you didn't want to do that, it's absolutely no problem. What we will need to do though is fill in this space now. So taking two rows of five yellow concrete, we're just going to fill that in like that. Awesome. Then we're going to take white concrete and we're going to make the same sort of Simpsons eyes. So one, two, three. Oops, like so. Besides the nose, one, two, three, that side as well. We're going to go one, two, three. Then we're going to go around the corner and go one, two, three, up the top and one, two, three over the top. So around the corner, one, two, three, and over the top, one, two, three, once again. Now we're going to make sure we leave a middle block for the pupil. So we're going to go all the way around until we reach that one block in the middle. Doing the same over here. So you can basically go making a square shape and black concrete in the middle like so. That is awesome. Now to add in the eyelashes, we're going to add a block of black concrete in there. And then two diagonally off the side of that one. So Marge is starting to look a bit evil. Oh, maybe she's annoyed at Bart. Who knows? So then we're going to add a block over here, leaving a block gap. And one down here. Doing the exact same over the opposite side as well. 
There we go, she looks a little bit more calm. That's good. <laughs> so then we're gonna go around the corner and we're gonna add in our yellow sort of uh, concrete back here. So what we're gonna do is actually take two blocks and place them just there in that little gap there and two blocks around here, almost like cheeks, which is pretty cool. Wicked. Now what I'm gonna do is leave the sides empty for now. We're gonna go back to them in a minute. I'm gonna take my blue wool and I'm going to start to make a little bit of the design for Marge's hair. So we're going to go ahead and start on this block over here. Now you'll notice over on this one, it actually does overhang a little bit. So if you wanted to overhang it, you could. I'm going to do it on my one. Um, but if you wanted to leave it kind of straight back, you know, into sort of uh, Marge's face a little bit, you could do that as well and look just as cool. So let's go ahead. We place the block there so you can place another block out. Place a block there, place another block out. That looks great. Then we can go ahead and add these over the top. And in between those eyelashes, we're going to add yellow blocks of concrete. One there, one there, and one there. Wicked. She's starting to look like she's got a little bit of a hat on. But we want to make this hat turn into a haircut. So let's go ahead and do that now. Okay then, guys. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to go up 11 blocks on the sides of the hair. So we've got two. We're going to go three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Then we're going to go in a block for 12 for these two, then in a block for 13, and then on the 14th one, we're going to leave that for now, and we're going to go two blocks along from that 14th block. And that is going to be where we come back down. So we're going to make the 11 over here, so 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That should line up, it does, that's lovely. Go in for our 12th go in for our 13th and then go in one more time for our 14th and that connects up which is great that's what we wanted for you okay then we can go ahead and fill in this entire space with our blue wool to match up for the rest of the haircut so actually coming round to the left side of Marge's head what we are going to do is we're going to take our yellow concrete and we're going to fill the rest of this neck area over like so so we have basically a row of four blocks like so which is great. Now up here on this two where we built the cheeks, we're going to make this go along another two blocks for a three long shape like so. Now we're going to bring these bottom two and go along to the opposite side to make these stack up as well by two and then bring the cheeks along for three blocks. So just add the two like so. Wicked, that's starting to look really, really great. Now on top of these two blocks we added a minute ago, like at the square, we're actually going to add two blocks sticking out from the head there for the ears of Marge and these just go two blocks away from the uh, the eyeballs as well. Do the same on both sides and that looks great. Now we can actually take our blue wool and we can go up the side and over the top of Marge's ear just like so and then round the corner just to our eye there as well. So doing the exact same over here. So kind of up the ear, connect up that corner and go out for the eye just like so. That is amazing. And now this one does actually run kind of parallel to the um, the top of the hair as well. Uh, I'm just going to go double check a section and then we'll get back onto the build. Okay then guys, so I've just gone and double checked the other Marge over there. And I found the dimensions of this haircut. So this actually goes up by 13 blocks just above the ear. And now we have these two drop down. This one also goes 13 blocks up. So we're going to go 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 so it should match up just to there and we can add a couple blocks over on this kind of perm at the top of my just hair and we can go ahead and add the 13 this side as well wicked so it should basically be in line with this 11 that we built at the front so we're going to go ahead and add 13 for these two lines as well and do this one as well like so and then we'll do the same over here and this is kind of the, the part that sticks out of the uh, head the most, really, which is cool. So there's not actually much difference between the rest of the body. So where we built this little block back here that goes kind of in from the front, we're going to bring this one back just three blocks from that one. And then we're going to drop all the way back down. Back, back down these 13. So until we reach basically the back of Marge's hair. And you can overhang it a little bit at the back. It won't matter too much. It actually looks pretty good if you do overhang it for that one block. Um, just because it adds a little bit more detailing to the thing. Actually, I'm going to add two blocks just so it's filled up. It's filled up there as well. Alright, so I'm going to do the same over here. I'll go a little bit slower. So from this block, one, two, three. 
And on the third one, we make this one drop all the way back down to the bottom of Marge's cheek bone just there. That looks great. So now what we can do is actually go from this block and this block just here and go right the way up to Marge's head at the top, just like so. And of course, bring this one the same up the top and just a block over the top like so. Now, as you'll notice, there is actually a weird sort of, I don't know, there's a little bit of a hill at the top of Marge's hair. You see what I mean? It is very bizarre. So what we're going to do is kind of make sure that hill is visible to the rest of the build. So we're going to go ahead and add it in very, very soon. So we've got this one going around the corner, which is great. We're going to go ahead and add another one that goes even further out of the body like this. So out of the head, just a little bit more. So we're going to add this row of about five like this. So bring this one up. Don't worry if your head is hollow. That is actually a good thing in Minecraft. It saves you a little bit of time. Alrighty, so we're going to bring this one right up to the same dimensions as we built the other one just a minute ago. Actually, I'm just going to knock that one down just a slight block. Make sure that uh, has a little bit more difference in it. Alright, so we've got all these five pillars going for us now, which is great. That is looking good. So we can go ahead and level these ones out as well just to make it look a little bit more clean and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this one back to about there that looks cool and then uh, yep that's good and then over here what I'm going to do is just complete that one off like that so Marge's actual hair is very very big as you guys know so I don't want to make it too big in Minecraft especially for the scale we're building this hair we don't want to make it look very very huge compared to the actual face so I'm going to do this little design over here so on this one just going to bring it along to this point just here wicked so as you'll notice it goes into a little bit of a i don't know like i said a little bit of a hill at the back so if you wanted to kind of just chop some blocks through add a little bit more detailing around so just chop this one through knock these one off like that maybe you could do that make it a little bit more personalized as well but i think that looks pretty good from the front thank you so much for watching this video, awesome video guys i really hope you've enjoyed learning how to build marge simpson in minecraft if you did, please definitely smash that big blue button over there. That'd be awesome. And if you would like to subscribe for the entire Simpsons series, please do that. That'd be amazing as well. You guys have a wicked day. Stay safe. Definitely stay tuned. And I'll see you at the next week's video coming very, very soon. Goodbye for now.